if we stop paying attention to the funding of scientific research, the funding of basic science research, um, we really are burning our future. We are really killing our future. Are we losing some benefits of scientific research already as labs suspend their activity? Very much so. I mean, there is quite a bit of research that has been stopped. Research in academia, stop start doesn't work. Once you stop something, once the laboratory is closed, once we lose the people, once we lay off people who have the experience and the expertise on the research we're doing, we lose a tremendous amount. So despite, you know, the headlines of what's been going on, um, you know, the first half of 2025 was actually quite strong in the Boston startup ecosystem. We continued to see a lot of activities, but obviously the headlines and the, and the pause in funding and research has been very disruptive. We've seen really important uh, research, particularly in the world of healthcare and biotech, get paused. There have been job cuts, and there's just been a general environment of volatility the last couple months. From an underscore perspective, we, our deal flow has remained consistent. We continue to see these exceptional teams coming out of this ecosystem, and the, the entrepreneurial spirit and the capabilities and technological unlocks are still quite strong. In any innovation economy, you have multiple pieces to it. There's a talent piece to it. There's a research piece to it. There's a funding piece to it. And obviously, the federal funding is an important component to the research dimension. So what we will need to do is find alternative sources of funding.